like working out outside? Yeah, it's nice. Yeah, it's nice. Nice breeze. Do you, do you miss being in the weight room though? Yeah. Yeah. It is an attitude, right? This is not the most inventive office in the world, right? This stuff was run back before I was even born, probably in the 40s. Hoping mostly that this transfers into our regular offense so we go that way when we try to run the ball and not back and forth back here and praying to God our running back makes guys miss. You got me? Get a break at your offensive coaches. It was like butterflies, you know? It was like, I don't know, kind of like winning a Super Bowl or winning a championship, something crazy that you know, you've been waiting on for almost a whole year, and it's finally came true. Even when we were shut down, I would do home home workouts. I'd push my truck up a hill. I'd do anything. Life of a night practice, COVID coach with a not lit field. Don't sit there and absorb. Baseball is down there. We don't catch you. We attack you. Let's go. That's it. That's it. That's what I want. Every single time. Set it up. Set up offense going towards the scoreboard. Hey, lock them out there. I'm like the better. Okay, rotate. Here we go. Blake Thomas. Um, he's our starting quarterback. He started for us the last six games as a sophomore. Uh, he's a junior right now. He's also a two-sport athlete. He started last year as a sophomore as a third baseman on the varsity baseball team. And now he's a second baseman on the varsity baseball team. And he's just a good person. I think he currently has a 4.9 GPA. He is ranked number one in the junior class. I don't really lead by my words, but more like by example. I don't like to talk or yell, but I do like to just do what's right. The next one's Vito Collier. Uh, he's a senior. He is a returning first team All Hill North Hills League guy for us. Um, he plays defensive end. He's a high motor guy. He flies around. You never see Vito going half speed. Um, he's passionate. He has aspirations to play in college, and I think he can. For running back, I bring a power and speed. And for defensive end, I bring hustle and power. Caden Carlson, uh, number 23. Caden this year is kind of a jack of all trades for us. Um, he is a returning starter. He plays corner and he's playing some wideout. Um, he's also our punter and he's our place kicker. But he's also a kid starter on the varsity soccer team. Um, so he'll be playing a soccer game out here tomorrow and then come to practice afterwards. What did you miss most about playing football? Uh, probably the brotherhood we have. I mean, we got a tight group of seniors and now bringing up the, even the freshmen who we don't really get to practice with, but getting them in the program and preparing them for the rest of their high school careers, is, it's fun to do. Jackson Smith is a returning MVP for our team. Um, he starts at running back for us and at our strong safety position. Uh, he returns kicks for us too. He's a tough-nosed kid, um, another multiple sport athlete. He plays baseball on the varsity baseball team. Uh, he just loves the game. Um, he's a guy that always goes 100%. To the team, I feel like I bring a lot of like emotion and leadership and like, a l like just a lot of those qualities that like y some of the younger guys are gonna want to follow and have when they uh, come up as as they become a senior and grow older into the program. John Ramirez is my starting left tackle. He's a junior, uh, returning starter for us. Um, and he battled some injuries at the end of last season. I think kind of this delay has helped him be fully healthy. Um, and he's got a bright future ahead of him, smart young man, very athletic. He's got size, uh, which, you know, we have now um, better than we have in the past years. Just to have fun, to let all the, the I, I, almost like anger, I guess, for the past year, and like, we haven't been able to release or release anything this entire year, so. Javier Lopez, um, number 41. He actually was a defensive player of the game for a week, uh, game last week versus El Medina. Um, he transferred to us a couple years ago. Uh, unfortunately, didn't play last year as a junior, um, but he's you know kind of shown exactly what we knew we would see from him. Tough, hard-nosed kid. Plays some starts for us at middle linebacker 
and uh, plays running back for us as well. Just a high energy motor guy that likes to be out here, just loves football. I feel like I bring a lot of intensity and a lot of fire to the team. I bring that kind of edge, especially as a transfer from a different school. Uh, I feel like I need a, in a way, I've been here for two years, so I, I need to earn my spot still, even though I'm a senior, and show them that I am a part of this program and uh, I'm family. Hey, bring it up, take a knee. Quickly, quickly, quickly. Great job. Way to come out focused today. It's good to see some of you uh, injured guys in helmets and shoulder pads. Get a break. See you tomorrow. Hey, bring it up. Hey, family on three. One, two, three. Family.